I like the idea that my robots and uh, these two in particular are made out of um, scrap material, recycled stuff. And uh, it's stuff that you'd find in a, a local dump or a trash can or your own wheelie bin. Bits of metal tube, drain pipes, that kind of stuff. And the flexible, I don't know, a flexible hose pipe from an old washing machine or something. And, uh, you know, I'd like to get a bit of uber super glue stuff or something or a, or a welding set and uh, i don't know about the welding i think i'll be very good at that uh anyway if i could get the right material and, and stick this all together and create a three-dimensional doodle and put it in my garden as a piece of sculpture a statement my creativity and i'd leave it there until the neighbours say, Mick, you've, you've left this piece of junk in the garden and it's, it's bringing down the tone of the neighbourhood. Could you please do something about it? And that would happen. You see this cream blocks of, of, of shapes in the, in the background? Those are to give me some boundaries to draw within so I don't draw myself into a corner because I draw quite quickly, so I'm not really pay attention. I don't have an overall composition like an artist would painting a picture. I just keep going until it's finished. So that's what they, and they work really well. It just stops me drawing myself into it, into a mess, you know. And uh, the shade I'm putting in now, shadows, whatever you like to call them, they're not, it's not um, shadows like a, an artist would do. They're, they're just shapes of, of colour, dark areas, just to hold this guy against the, the, the white background. So he's he's got a bit of prominence. I say guy, it might not be a, a male figure. It might be uh, something else. I don't know. Uh, yeah, well, life's complicated at the moment, isn't it? Anyway, here we go, orange and... Um, I've talked to my, I talk about talking, drawing yourself into a corner. I've just talked to myself into a corner. So there you go. That there's um, yellow for the eyes. I, would, I like the idea of these glowing eyes because they, they make him look like he's got some sort of awareness. Yeah, he, he, suddenly he looks quite, um, whatever you like, confused, aggressive, whatever. But it looks like he's aware as to what's going on. And if I put pupils in there, it would just look like a cartoon character. Anyway, we're, we're near the end now. So once again, I'd like to say thank you for watching. And please do subscribe and press the um, notifications bell. And thank you for watching.